I, I can't I can't handle this appointment. Don't you dare do that to me. As a gaming YouTuber, I've done basically every job you can imagine. I've been a cashier, I've made ice cream, I've been a secretary, I've done pottery, I've done a little bit of everything in terms of gaming. But have we actually worked a proper office job? I think that's going to be an important question to answer, especially that we're playing Office Life 3D. And the icon is an absolutely adorable computer with some colorful keyboard keys. I have to say, this icon kind of reminds me of the VR version of Job Simulator. I've played these games on my VR headset on PlayStation, and I have to say, I really do like them. Maybe I'm dorky, but there's something about Office VR work. It's kind of interesting, and I really did enjoy Vacation Simulator. Maybe I should go out more. Maybe I should. Listen, I'm just this huge sucker for anything VR. I love playing those games. But let me know in the comments, what kind of games would you like to play virtually? What what office? I, I know I'm asking for a job. What job would you like to do without the repercussions? And this game does have 3.3 thousand ratings at 4.5 stars. And when we look at the pictures in the app store, we see Call Patrick Parkman. And it looks like the phone number is 8515. And this is a rotary phone. This is an antique phone. I don't know if any of you trash pandas have these at home, but I'm pretty sure most people don't know how to use them now. You kind of got to rotate the dial in the number that you want. So I'm thinking they're trying to see, they're, tr they're trying to find out our ages, aren't they? Lucky for you, I know how to use it because my dad still has one. <laughs> and it looks like we're shredding paper or are we sending out invoices? I'm not sure what's happening here. And then we have a cute computer with one, four, five, and then enter. So I'm not, I'm not clear on the objectives yet. So I'm sure, oh, look at that. It looks like we're going to be throwing cups inside the trash bin. And I'm not sure what's going on here. And I'm guessing I'm going to have to plug some stuff. This is interesting. I don't know what to expect. It looks like this was even level 71. Level 48 looks like we're gonna have to organize some files and cabinets and things. And then we have to organize office supplies, which I'm okay with, but that's all we're getting. I'm guessing this is going to be an organization game or maybe an ASMR game, I'm hoping. So let's hope for some sound effects. If there's no sound effects, kitty editor, I do apologize. I don't choose these games because there's no sound effects. I just choose the games and sometimes the games choose me. I don't have a say. Sometimes I'm the victim too, Kitty Ender. <laughs> and I'm pretty sure Kitty Ender doesn't believe me, right? Mm-hmm. I know. All right, without further delay, let's go ahead and see what Office Life 3D has to offer us. Okay, so we do have a character. So far we haven't seen the character, but maybe it's a... Okay, they just threw a bunch of stuff. Can we, can we hear any sound? No, no sound. And then we have the staplers. Are these staplers? I think these are hole punchers. Is that it? Not even any sound for the confetti? Oh no. Okay, we don't have to worry about sound effects. We're just going to go ahead and organize and see what ends up happening. If it gets a little bit more difficult, hold to fill. Let's go in. Oh my goodness. Wow. <coughs> That's a lot of people. Let's go people. We have deadlines to fill. Woo. <laughs> okay. <laughs> fill elevator. Okay, these are checklists. Let's go ahead and put the plugs and we turn the windows on. Plug devices, and then we have a math problem, 14. Wait, what, oh no, no, hang on, can I, 143. I'm trying to see what happens if we get it wrong. Eight, T5, 24. Okay, what happens now? Desk job, check! <gasps> it does, I wanted to do this wrong. I want, okay, phone book, let's go ahead. Crystal, we have to do 4065, so press on the four. Zero, six, five. There we go, it says welcome. Call clients, we just called one. What, what am I supposed to do here? I'm gonna shred this one. Okay, I'm gonna do the sound, we, we keep that one. No, no, I didn't mean it! <laughs> oh no! Um, yeah, I guess we have to retry. All right, so we're gonna shred this one. And we keep this one, we keep this one, we shred this one, and we shred that one. There, that's the sound effect now. <laughs> what am I doing here? Am I, oh, oh. How many? Okay, we got one. We got two. Oh no. <gasps> we got three. This is throw jump. This is probably the weirdest office game we've played. These are just a bunch of mini games. Insert cash. What do they want me to do? Put the money. Press play. Okay, it's counting money. 480. Um, do I just take the money into the envelope? Okay. Insert cash. This is gonna be the 260, isn't it? Probably. 260. Put you in the envelope. We gotta put these properly because we have to pay people. So we have to make sure that our money is counted and placed. Oh, one for Marge, Homer, and Jeremy. Okay, the names were very random. And now we're organizing staplers. No, these are not, we have staplers. Okay, coffee, coffee, 
um, pencil sharpeners. <laughs> okay. Okay. And well, this game is starting. Okay, we're starting to get into the territory of repetitiveness. I'm not sure why this game would have gotten a good rating if we're going in circles here. Okay, so let's go ahead and fill the elevator. We're still doing the same thing over and over. Let's go, people. Let's go. We have deadlines. I really hope this game is not just 10 levels of repetitiveness. Let's see. We have more plugs. Let's go ahead and do you and do you. I'm a little worried here. I'm a little worried. So let's just go put a, the right answer right away. Oh, we actually have to do three different problems. Okay, let's go ahead and do that and get the math problems all done. And we're calling Rachel. Nine. Hello. I'm doing it. Nine. What's happening? Four. I don't understand what's happening. Six. Six. I think some of the buttons were broken. Hey, did I, I did this okay? We are going in circles. You know what? Let me try and get to level 20 and see if we're still looping here. So let's keep going. We need to keep both these ones. We're gonna shred this. Keep that one. Keep that one. Uh oh, I think we needed to keep all the other ones. <laughs> did I do it? Apparently I did it. I'm gonna throw paper. Let's go throw paper. I am a pro at this. Look at me. Throw junk. Oh game, do not disappoint me. Let's go ahead and put the pounds. Don't disappoint me, game. I, I, can't, I can't handle disappointment. Don't you dare do that to me. I'm really curious. If it's just 10 rounds of repetitiveness, then we gotta try another game. Oh no. Let's put our calculators and our staplers. We got this. Come on. No. No, 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 no. We do not like that. Let's see what happens. What is this game? Oh no. Oh, we burst everyone. <laughs> I wanted to see what was gonna happen here. Retry. Oh no. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna get to level 30 on my own and see if it changes from there. Because according to the picture in the app store here, we're supposed to get different levels. Like cutting the paper over here, that's the only difference, huh? I'm gonna get to level 30, let's see what happens. A little longer than a few minutes later. So I've made it to level 31 and we have just constantly been looping over the same games over and over. And we are just not going anywhere here. It's just, we're just going in circles. This game is not offering us any different. It's it's really just the same levels over and over. Let, let's, let's try another office simulator game. And this next office game probably is the most realistic one because it's called Try to Stay Awake. <laughs> if any of us have worked any kind of office job, we know that sometimes it's just hard to keep your eyes open, especially when the work is redundant. And this seems to be a running game where we have to get up, get dressed, Go to bed in time to make it to a meeting, I'm guessing. It looks like there is a corporate meeting at the front part of this game. And we're drinking energy drinks and then going to bed again in some funny looking pajamas. I think we're a mushroom. And then we're falling asleep while standing. And that's it. This game is broken everywhere else. So I guess there's only one way to find out what's this game about. And the last update is nobody knows. And there's no reviews. So let's see what Stay Awake has in store for us. Tap to start. Is there any music? Mm, no. Let's go ahead and walk. Zap. We, we do want to stay awake, so we're gonna take some coffee, and we're we're. This is not even a running simulator. This is a this is a sleeping simulator. Is that a toothbrush? Okay, we're gonna toothbrush <laughs> in our face. Let's go ahead and shave. And the meter for sleep keeps going up. How far are we gonna make it? We're gonna make it to our meeting. Success. Yay, we, we made it. We have holes under our armpits though. Maybe we should have gotten some sleep. Maybe that would have been good for us. Let's go ahead and continue. And you know what? I'm gonna go ahead and sleep. I wanna see what happens if we fall asleep. Oh my goodness, yeah, we are definitely sleeping. We are definitely sleeping here. What's happening now? I don't know what's happening. We're just, we're just gonna zap our way up. We're not gonna make it to our meeting, are we? We are, we are definitely not making it. This is a really garbage game. Wow, I did not expect this game to be absolute trash. And then they have you restart. So you don't have much of a choice than to actually just make it. So let's see if we don't make it to the meeting. I don't wanna make it to the meeting. I just wanna make it to the multipliers and see what happens from there. So we're gonna avoid this clock. We're gonna take this. We do have to take a little zap over here and see what happens if we don't make it to the meeting. Are we still happy? What? Wait, I did make it to the meeting. Well, fail. We just dead it on the ground here. What's, what is going, wake up, wake up. I don't understand because we still had energy and we did make it to the meeting. This game is all sorts of confusing. 
I think office games are generally speaking hit or miss, just like an office job. Unless it's Job Simulator, that's actually pretty fun. I'm just gonna say that the, both of these games are absolutely dumpster fire. If you're looking for a proper office type game, I'm gonna say Hyper PA is actually pretty good. It's entertaining, it's nonsensical, but at least it's got content. If you do want to watch that, make sure you click up here. If you want to watch a live stream that you may have missed, make sure you check down here until then. I'll see you next time. Bye, game!